we are announcing that starting from this Friday, the university is going to be on strike until further notice. What do you mean on strike? We have just been here a week and there is already a strike? I tell my parents on Skype. This is impossible. There is no organization here. Everything is unknown. Last minute, up in the air. And the buses are so confusing and never on time. They look at me in silence for a second and say, But Sara, you are used to this. It's just like home. What is the difference? It's just like home. Just like home. In that moment, I realized that I had forgot what home was or where home was. Being in the United States as an international student, I had adapted to many ways of living that are characteristic of the US and started to see those as normal and not foreign anymore. I had sort of disconnected from the rest of my identity. Pretty soon into my experience abroad, I realized how being in Mexico was connecting me to my own identity. ¿Quién va a la fiesta? Sara, who is going to the party? Sara, people would say. Sara la italiana. They would say to distinguish me from the other Sarah who was from the United States. The minute that people learned that I was from Italy, they started seeing me differently from all the other students. I was not a gringa, and when talking to me, they would refer to similarities between Mexico and Italy. Family is important in Italy too, right? You are more affectionate, more physical. You guys kiss people on the cheeks too, see? In part they were stereotypes, but in part it was true. There were some aspects of my culture, of my identity, that I had put in a box deep down in the back of my brain. When taking the bus or hanging out with friends, staying with my host family, all of these parts of my identities came out again. Sara la Italiana. I was a little like the other American students, we shared the way I studied, the way I lived for most of the year, we shared a language, and I was faced with my own Italian identity many times. With the Mexicans, I shared some behaviors, some habits, some rules and manners. Our languages had the same words many times. There I was, Sara, an international student studying abroad abroad, but at the same time returning home. Ho imparato e aprendido. I learned a lot during my time in Mexico. I learned that I can adapt well to new environments, that knowing three cultures allows me to be prepared for many situations, and that each part of my identity is important. And all of the things I learned in Italy, the US, or Mexico are me.